Hello, welcome to the channel Kids Cloud. Today we are going to explore our solar system. Everybody, including kids, always amazed and fascinated by the sky and space. That makes things us, the world beyond our imagination. The solar system is a part of that world which forces us to think how small we are compared to universe. Let's try to understand it. It is interesting to know the composition of solar system. Solar system includes the star which is our sun, then planets which includes Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune and dark planet Pluto. Besides dozens of moons, asteroids, comets and meteoroids are the part of solar system. The biggest and prime part of our solar system is the sun. The sun is formed more than 4.5 billion years ago. The sun is the star and it is the largest object in our solar system. It is our closest star that's why it look bigger from earth. It contain 99.8% of solar system's mass. The life on earth is possible due to the heat and light provided by sun. Planets are spinning around the sun in a fixed path that is called as orbit. This picture is showing the position of planets in solar system with respect to sun. It shows that Mercury is the nearest planet to sun while Neptune is the farthest. Our earth has one satellite that is our moon. These eight planets are divided into two groups. Inner planets includes Mercury, Venus, Earth and Mars. These inner planets are also called as terrestrial planets. Due to their similar size and composition with that of Earth, they are also called as Earth-like planets. These planets mainly made up of iron and rock. Let's study these planets in more detail. Mercury. Mercury is the closest and smallest planet in the solar system. As it is nearest to the sun, it is the fastest planet among all. Second nearest planet to the sun is Venus. Venus is called as Earth's sister planet as it is comparable in size and gravity to that of Earth. It is the hottest planet in the solar system. Third nearest planet to the sun is Earth. It is our planet. It is the single planet in the solar system where life exists. After Earth, there comes Mars. It is the fourth nearest planet to sun. This planet is also called as red planet due to the presence of iron oxide on its surface. Second group of this planet is called as outer planets which includes Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune. These are also called as Jovian or giant planets. Jupiter and Saturn mainly compose of hydrogen and helium while Uranus and Neptune additionally contains ice and rock. Let's learn some distinct features of these outer planets. Jupiter. Jupiter is the biggest planet in the solar system. It is also called as gas giant. Next is Saturn. Saturn is spinning next to Jupiter in the solar system. It is referred as gas giant similar to Jupiter. It is easily recognized planet due to its seven rings. Next come Uranus. It is referred as ice giant. It mainly contains ammonia, methane, water and hydrocarbon in the form of ice. It is the coldest planet in the solar system. Eighth and the last planet in the solar system is Neptune. Like Uranus, it is also referred as ice giant. We cannot see this planet with naked eye 
due to its large distance from sun other than this eight planets there is one more planet which is called as dwarf planet it is named as pluto pluto is referred as dwarf planet means it is neither a true planet nor a natural satellite it is smaller in size than earth's moon it is mainly made up of ice and rock it has five known moons third components of this solar system includes asteroids meteoroids and comets asteroids are small rocky objects majority of asteroids orbit the sun in a band this band lies between orbits of mars and jupiter this belt is called as asteroid belt the first and largest asteroid was named as ceres meteoroids the fragments of asteroids that fall on ground on earth are called as meteoroids when meteoroids encounter our earth's atmosphere they get vaporized and becomes hot this burning meteoroid is called as a meteor when earth encounters many meteoroids at once we call it a meteor shower comets comets are the small bodies like asteroids which orbit the sun these are made up of frozen ammonia methane or water and only small amounts of rock and dust particles like planets they orbit the sun in an elliptical path as compared to planets their path is more elliptical when these comets get closer to sun ice starts melting and the gases form these gases along with dust particles makes cloud around the nucleus which is called as coma due to pressure of sunlight some dust particles are evaporated and pushed away from nucleus this forms the tail of comets so this is all about our solar system thanks for watching this video of solar system for more videos please subscribe this channel